All right, Ray, thanks so much. A huge crane lifted a garbage truck several dozen feet into the air this evening in the Hill District. That truck got stuck when a parking pad collapsed earlier today. The operation took hours, and Fifth Avenue is still closed tonight. Chris Hoffman was there as the truck was removed. He joins us live with more on how they got the job done. Chris? Good evening, Susan. Yeah, once they got the straps on that truck, it was just a few moments before they got it up over the power lines and plopped it right down onto Fifth Avenue with no real problems at all. A great job goes out to the entire crew, the riggers, the operator, uh, you know, every one of them is outstanding. After 13 hours, the garbage truck is out after it partially fell through a concrete pad on Fifth Avenue around 730 Monday morning. Allegheny crane and rigging was called at 10 this morning to help remove the truck. The crane took almost two and a half hours to set up. They had to wait till after rush hours, make sure nothing happened. And then it took a little, a little while to sister up, but it didn't move. The idea is when you pick it up, it doesn't move. It didn't move once. In a matter of minutes, the 60,000 pound truck was lifted like a toy and put gently down onto Fifth Avenue. According to Allegheny crane and rigging's Kirk Pyros, it all went perfectly considering their challenges. Power had to be cut nearby as a precaution. Power lines building getting set up on a hill. Right? I mean, if you look at it, he's cribbed up underneath on a hill. You're on a, you're on a slope. You're cribbed up, making sure nobody gets hurt. And no one was hurt. There were no injuries in this whole process. Now, those crews are still out here. They're still currently working in the area of Fifth Avenue between the Birmingham Bridge and Robinson Street. They're expected to be out here for about another hour or so because it takes about three hours for them to take the crane apart. Once they're gone, Fifth Avenue should be reopening. We're live in the Hill District tonight. Chris Hoffman, KDKA News.